back to World of Mechanics. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing to the channel. In today's video, guys, if you have a Ford engine, guys, 3.5 or 3.7 on Ford Taurus or Ford Fusion Sport, guys, and you're wondering, okay, about the timing marks, timing chain marks, and all that stuff, stay with us and we're going to explain, guys, what needs to be done. Now, this same engine, guys, is used on Ford Edge as well, so that's why we're demonstrating on Ford Edge, but practically it's exactly the same engine as the one in Ford Taurus and Ford Fusion Sport 3.5 engine. Or the 3.7, again, with the single variable timing gears. Now, let me, guys, introduce you to the channel. Every car we get at the shop, guys, will make at least 200 videos. Our goal? Save you as much money as we can by teaching you guys how to fix your car for free. All we need in return, please guys give a subscribe. Okay, and a like. Now, this is the timing chain, the whole kit. You can find it listed in the description of the video below, guys, for your convenience. This is the whole kit. Uh, also, guys, okay, we have a water pump. Okay, I would definitely recommend if you're replacing the chain, put a new pump to you. Why? Because this is a timing chain driven water pump. Okay, this one right here. And you don't want to do that job again because if you don't replace the water pump now, you have to do it in the future again. And you can see you have to remove the timing chains to get to the water pump. So avoid that, guys. Don't don't just uh, work extra if you have to. So all the tools and parts, including pump, timing chain kit, and special timing tools, will be listed in the description of the video below. Okay, for uh, your convenience, guys. Okay, you can see. That's the two right there. We have the two in the back as well. Okay, these two. And how you guys set the timing now? The engine needs to be a TDC point. TDC, top dead center. You have to have the twos in place. Okay, you can see these twos. Now we need to make sure that this dot right here. Okay, there is a dot to match that gold link. Okay, you can see this dot with that gold link. On the back side, okay, you're going to match, let me remove that too. Okay, you're going to uh, match this dot here, okay, with this gold link right there. Okay, let me see if I can show you, okay, this dot right there. On the back side you have the same thing, it's really hard for me to show but you can see the dot there, gold link and uh, you have one more over there, okay, this one with the gold link as well. So once you set the inner chains you can install the top one, okay, this is the big chain now, you can see that long thing and now what do you guys do for that one, okay, you can see you have that gold link here okay with that dot needs to be matching this gold link okay with this dot here and then on the bottom gold link dot okay so this is it guys, pretty much the whole timing marked video. However, the whole video guys from start to finish it's on our channel so please check it out in the description of the video below for your convenience. Uh, it's a long video but it's from start to finish so you can see how it's done. So thank you guys for watching, please subscribe to the channel for more videos and see you guys next time.